This guy is awesome. Ciao friends, Beth with Thimble Hooks, and I got some new hooks. Surprise! Surprise, I got new hooks. These are all divot soaps that I got off Amazon, and they are, I love these hooks. You've seen me use them already, but these are new ones. So let's see what's in the box. You never know what you're going to get either. It's kind of funny. This box is not labeled and it's broken. This box is absolutely perfect as is this one. And this one had no box at all and was just tossed in an Amazon bag and I'm just shocked it made it here with get it without getting broken. So just crazy. You never know what you're going to get I guess. But this one doesn't have a box. But let's see what I have here. This one is a five and a half millimeter. Ooh. This is the turquoise one. Oh, I love it. Look at that. That's a, oh, that's awesome. It is a resin. So it's a plasticky one. Resin. And it's like a nice teal turquoise color. Oh, I love it. And it's a five and a half. This one wasn't labeled. I had to, I had to uh, look it up. So, again, the label wasn't there on that one. But how cute is this? I'm going to use him in a moment. Let's see what's in this one. Let's see. Oh, this box wasn't perfect. This one was ripped. But on the inside, so you didn't necessarily notice it. This guy is just too cute. Isn't that adorable? It has a really nice holding spot right here. This is just great. I love it. This one is... It is beach. This is beech wood. And it's a six millimeter and it is just cute. It is so different than any of my other ones. The divot people just keep making making more and making more and making cute stuff here. These are just just too much fun. But this is beach wood. It's really lightweight. It's very, very soft, very ergonomic. I like I like that. I like the little holdy spot holdy spots. This is great. And this one is labeled. This one was not labeled anywhere on it. I had to look it up. It wasn't labeled on the box and it's not labeled on the hook. That's not cool. You lose brownie points for me without having anything labeled. But this one is awesome and it's labeled very clearly. So, okay, you got your brownie points back. There's a box. Let's see what's in this one. I don't even remember. What are you? Oh! This one is also a five and a half. And it is coffee. It's all swirl. This one is resin too. Tink, tink, tink. But it's brown and white all swirled together. I imagine that every one of these is unique. This is just gorgeous. I love it. Very ergonomic. Great handle. Lots of lots of swirls in here. This is so much fun. This side is more plain, but over here is busy. Very busy. Oh, I love it. And then this guy, oopsie, I have to do a thank you shout out to Carol Rivera for letting me know that they had three and a half. I haven't been able to find a nice three and a half millimeter in a divot shelf or in a anything. They've just either they don't have them or they've been out of stock or whatever. And she said, go check Amazon. They're back in stock. And I got one. I'm so excited. So I use a three and a half often. So this is the 3.5 millimeter and it is walnut. Even though it looks like it's maple, it's actually walnut. It's just not the heartwood. So it's the lighter shade of the walnut. But it looks a lot like the resin one except this one is wood and this one's not, but the idea behind it is exactly the same. With this. So cute. Oh, I love them. And they're all so different. This is great. Okay, I'm going to try them out. I have a little bit of Karen Simply Soft here. This one is Robin's Egg. 
and it calls for a five millimeter hook and none of these are a five. This is a three and a half, but I'm going to try it anyway. It's really nice. Very smooth. Let's see if I get any kind of snags at all. Look at that, how smooth that is. It's sanded so nicely, not one snag, even with this tiny little three and a half millimeter hook. Oh, that was so nice, so special. And these are wonderfully priced, very qu high quality, I think. These are just great little hooks. I have quite a few, quite a few in my stash, in my, in my giant collection, and I use them often. These are really nice. So there's my little walnut one. He's adorable. Okay, I'll set you over here. This guy is so cute. What was he again? This beach? Yes, this is beach. So let's see what I can do with this guy. Oh, I already like this one a lot. This is a six millimeter. So it's going to be a little bit more of a struggle to get through the chains that I made with the three and a half, but I really like this hook already. I barely even used it yet and I love it. It has the perfect spot for my thumb. Look at that. It's absolutely perfect for my thumb. The way I hold my hook, this was made for me. So if you hold your hook knife-like, like I do, and not pencil, this seems like it's in a pretty darn good spot. Right there. <laughs> I'm going to use this all the time. Again, this was Beechwood and it is a six millimeter. I love that one too. And then the one that's not labeled, boo, and I had to look it up. It's a five and a half millimeter, so let's check him out. It's not labeled anywhere, so we're just gonna have to remember that forever. Yep, it's not labeled anywhere. But, oh well, what can you do? But let's give him a try. I don't know this, uh, the resin. This one and the the coffee one there are the new ones for me. Let's see if these are sanded and polished as nicely as the wooden ones always are. Ooh, they sure seem to be. I'm not getting any snags. No resistance at all. Oh, this is awesome. So that was my fault. Whoopsie. I missed. Well, Mr. Turquoise Teal 5.5 that's not labeled, he is still got many brownie points for being awesome. It is a very, very nice hook, sanded and, and carved perfectly. It does not have any snags at all. Lovely. Okay, we're three for three. Let's see what the last one is. This is one is the coffee one. This is resin too, just like this one. They, look like they generally have the same kind of a idea. All three of these do. They have all three of these have the same same turning, the same design. I'm going to use this last one, and he was also a five and a half, I believe. So often those are sold out. I'm lucky that I have a five and a half. So let's try him with his cute his cuteness. All right, I'm going to turn to be a little bit easier. Here we go. Again, this is a five and a half, and generally Karen Siplisoff wants you to use a five. I often use a five and a half anyway. Five and a half is such a popular size for regular old four weight. But you can get yarn anywhere. So having a whole bunch of five and a halves around doesn't hurt me at all. This is lovely. This is really nice. Not a snag at all. It's polished, carved and polished very nicely. All right, guys, we're four for four. 
these are my new ones. I got all of these on Amazon. Again, as always, we purchase these ourselves. We're, the Vitchell people are not sending me these and telling me to tell you how awesome they are. I really do like these hooks. and They're a great price point. All right, I'm going to go play with my hooks now. So thanks for stopping by. Thank you for supporting my small business. Please subscribe to my channel. Turn on notifications so you can see what I make with these. And I'll see you real soon. Thanks. Bye.